Hello, welcome back. Last time I met Sal and Ent, or at least what remained of him, and for some reason I'm saving in slot 3 right now? That was what I loaded. Oops, that's storage. I don't remember why I did this. Wouldn't I normally have saved in one of the first two slots? Did I have a save I was trying to preserve for some reason? I loaded the one with the most experience, and I think that makes sense. Anyway, I'm here, uh, in the castle this part of it. Uh, I want to go east and there's new exploration. I have the two keys I need to move on. And bones for dinner. And so are you. Soldier's body. Uh, right, so there's still the demon lord zone. I have a couple of more ideas for stuff to try there, so if I end up back there we can try some more stuff, but... I feel like it's a lot more likely I'm just going to find some important key piece of information or item or, you know, switch that makes bridges appear or something that's going to make it possible to move through there, but I don't know. I just can't tell what's going to be what. Let's go north. How about that? Dead body. Old and charred. Another crystal? That's like... Only a few steps from the one I just left. Well, good to have alternatives. Skeleton. Empty hallway with a door. Okay, is this a shortcut to the... Yeah, okay. Blank wall that I wouldn't otherwise be likely to check. Alright, so quick way through here. That to my east is the... Two doors I need to put my keys in. Alright, um, this is probably not as quick a way to get there. There could be more hidden passages. I don't really want to look for them unless I have a reason to. It's kind of a pain to do that. Okay, so you. Broken sword. Skeleton. Stairs. Ooh, you're a different dragon. Drago Master. This is a title of very high rank. No one knows why Drago Newt, who is more powerful than the king, obeys King Alfred, who is merely a human. Oh, you have a weird ring brush breath attack. And a roar that didn't hit me. Or was that a bite? Either way, it didn't hit me. And a sad, huge turning radius that just, like, renders you absolutely unable to do anything. This is terrible. Like, I'm almost gonna let this dragon hit me just out of pity or something, because this is just... What is this? This is not a fight. This is just... Just sad. Drago Master. Master of nothing. <laughs> wow. What an incredibly glaring huge weakness. Like, what was that? Okay, there's another one. What do I have equipped? Wind cutter? Okay, there's a couple of them. With two at once, maybe they'll hit me once. Okay, you have an explosive thing. Okay, that's a lot more threatening. Okay, you're doing it repeatedly. I can't hear anything because... okay. But as long as you're not facing me, you won't do that. Alright, fair enough. You did something. Good for you. <laughs> uh. I'm just gonna chop up your hip for a little bit. And then you'll fall over. This is really sad, though. Ah. <laughs> uh. Alright. Oh, hey, you dropped, uh, what is that? Crown? Not everything is a crown. And that indeed is not one. Oh, it is, though. Phantom Crown. Um, special Armor Others. Okay, I might want to leave to identify this. Oh, 
or what if that's a special effect item that lets me, like, see phantom paths in the Demon Lord zone or use that inactive a teleport or something? <laughs> like, it's gotta be something that does it. Phantom crowns as likely as anything else, right? I think so. At the very least, I'll put it on the pile of ideas to try. There's probably nothing about it that I would instantly regret putting on. Let's try it. Okay, condition normal, no darkness effect or anything. Um, other than poison, all fours and threes for magic resist, 99, 93, 94. Same looking numbers, 99, 93, 94. Magic looks like that, power 106, wis 5. Power 106, Wiss 5, magic looks like that, okay. Well, no perceptible effect. I like the globe amulet, so I'm keeping that on. Uh, Alright, well, I'll, uh, I'll ask Mark about it and try it in the zone. Where am I? Did I turn around? No, I came down the other side, that's what happened. Alright, so did I look at this wall? Well, it's just just that wall. This reminds me of a spot in Kingsfield too. There was a place that looked just like this. Kinda. Okay, is there anything up here? Uh, no. Nothing. Wait, have I been to that central part of this room? Clunk. I mean, yes. There's nothing. It's just a place. Well, maybe the point was to come up there and get the phantom crown. Let's assume that. Am I trapped here? I can't squeeze through this little arrow hole. Oh, that opens. There we go. Okay. So, let's go s west, and then south, and then west. Got a carpet. More dragon oots. Alright, you do that. And this one shields me from it. Thanks for your services. Wind, magic up. How nice. Royal chest. It's another crown. <laughs> what are you? Ivory bracelet. This bracelet is embedded with a jewel from the brilliant stone that Icrius discovers. Uh, discovered. It helps the wearer to recover from a wound. Okay, so better than globe amulet, maybe? 167. 168. One sixty nine, yeah. Seems like just an upgrade to globe amulet. Great. Oops. Okay, this is something. Uh where are you? There you are. Just a skeleton.
Yeah, that's some okay recovery. All right, Drago Master, kneeling down. Your head brushes the ceiling here. Can't quite stand up all this way straight. Why do they keep you in here? My aggression is directed toward your left hip instead of the right one. Okay, power fruit. Nice. Did I eat the last one of those that I got? I think so. I did. Alright, uh, is that it? Appears to be. Okay, so I think the most sensible thing right now is to teleport. I'm gonna go to, uh... Ralugo. Let's identify... This, uh, what is it? Crown of something or other? Well, Mark can tell me all about it. And with this thing and the few additional ideas I had, I'm gonna go back into that Demon Lord zone once again and see if anything happens. Especially if he says something about, like, revealing hidden stuff or talking to stone heads or could be lots of things. Phantom Crown. Orlidan captured the fairies sent by Seath and Gyra and sealed them inside this crown. The power of magic is needed to reveal the secret entrance. It's a creation resulting from Orlidan's love of practical jokes. <laughs> no period. Okay. Uh, so this does sound fairly promising. So, Phantom Crown. Orlidan trapped the fairies sent by the gods to spy on him and sealed them inside this crown. The spirit is used to find the secret entrance. Okay, so put it on, maybe secret entrance, maybe also interacts with fairy fossil. Also something about a spell. I was thinking I could maybe like cast the Orlidan spell. I didn't uh, refill at the fountain while I was there. Cast the Orlidan spell at those faces or at the torches above or like... I tried to light the torch that was unlit, but maybe I want to put out the torches that are lit. My MP went up! Does a phantom crown do that, or is that an effect of the uh, other thing, I wonder? I think my MP went up, or maybe it went down. 248, 247. Oh, it goes down! This is an MP drain. Okay, so I don't want to wear this all the time. That's its downside. Yeah, this isn't happening from the other thing. That's that's clearly the crown doing that. Okay, do I have any flasks to fill? No. All right. Key. Uh, wherever you are. Uh, right. Walk back to the castle. It's a bit of a trip. Alright, sleeping quarters of Gyra. So, um, first of all, I'm gonna put on the Phantom Crown and see if it activates this teleporter. So, currently inactive. Phantom Crown on. Does not activate it. Okay. Okay, I guess I should check also here. Yeah, let's just have it on the whole time in here. Do you reveal anything there? No. So MP will be draining, that's fine. I'm expecting some, like, Aquarian Boots style, uh, something to show up if it's gonna show up. Ugh. Ugh. Stone faces, do you talk to me with this crown on? No. No bridge is revealing itself. I heard a noise. That might have just been part of the music. Okay, um, so... To, oops, well, okay, sure, yeah, I wanted to try that. Wait, did that? For a second I thought it, like, slowed the animation down when I hit it with it, but... Okay, so it doesn't seem to be Wind Cutter. I think I'm hitting that, probably. Let's try every spell. On both the faces and the, uh... The stuff around them. 
Well, every spell that makes any sense at all. So anything fiery gets targeted toward this. That does nothing. Pathetic. Here's a dragon. Nothing. Um, here, let's go straight to the most likely one to happen, which would be Orladen. I'm gonna cast this on the torch. I'm gonna cast it on a face. I'm gonna cast it on the other face. Gonna cast it toward this. I don't have enough MP for that, do I? It's being drained. There you are. Nothing. Nothing has changed. Fantastic. No, oh, wait, what? I. Okay. You use the fairy fossil there. I don't know if I needed the crown on for that. <laughs> I guess that's what you do. What an incredibly... Maybe there's a clue for this somewhere, but boy, is that obscure if there's not. Wow. I mean, it was an item that had to be useful for something. Is it just me or does it look like that bridge doesn't go all the way? Uh, there, now I can move. It does, okay. Just looked like it didn't. All right, I'm taking off this terrible crown. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> I was just about to turn back and give up again, but no, it actually took me here. Nice. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> oh, hey, it's that other thing I saw in my dream. The toothy wall. In a horrible fleshy place. This is unpleasant. Oh, is this Gyra? That's the Moonlight Sword, I think. It's so stubby. Well, that's the broken one, right? Okay, there we go. Proper Moonlight Sword. All repaired. Has it been renamed to Dark Slayer? Can't move. There, now I can. Moonlight Sword. This is not the Dark Slayer. Valid made this sword with the light magic. The famous Holy Sword, owned by King Alfred, will revitalize man's spirit and health. Neat! Okay, so another thing that refills my, my stuff. Yeah, those are some pretty good stats. The, uh... I have a sword with more slash than that. <laughs> but, that's pretty good. What about that other teleporter? Okay, so I unbroke the Moonlight Sword. That's great. I wonder if the Skeleton of Light needs to, like, infuse it further with power and, uh... Yeah, that was Gyra's spirit doing a thing, right? Oh, my MP's going up now. Did I take off that crown? I did. Okay, great. So, MP restoration. Good. What about behind there? That still looks like something. Did My, my fairy fossil shattered. So I don't have that anymore. Uh, I am here. Right, okay. This remains inactive. Why is it there, then? Well, maybe it'll activate someday later. All right, so Skeleton of Light. Can I do something with you? And do I remember the route to you? More or less. Also, how's the swing? Whoa, it charges quick. Oh, this is nice. I like that a lot. That's better than, uh, 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 what's that sword called? <laughs> I've already forgotten. Ryuga. Wow, okay, that's nice. Dude, didn't let it fully charge, didn't need to. Okay, this is very, very good, as it is. But it's not called Dark Slayer. Apparently it's supposed to be even better. I mean, like, of all things, did I really need a better weapon? <laughs> it's fine, though. I'll take it. Alright, Skeleton of Light should be on the left, either here or the next left. I think it might be the next one. 
Map says it's here. This place. He's gone. So I released him by doing that action? What? Are you sure? Alright, how far in are you? You're like the last one on the list, aren't you? Yeah, I think Alexander's the last one on the list. Light. After Gaia is defeated by Alexander, covered as a tomb, or lose victory. Gaia's consciousness, filled with hatred against Seath. Use it solely for the hope that Gaia's sword will be restored. Gaia and Mer'ur, among the most loathsome and lowly creatures, I pity them. King Alfred. But well, that's, that's valid. Uh. Just a little longer, then Gaia's consciousness will. I guess you're inside the sword now. Okay, was it Alexander who told me... The holy sword you carry is not the correct one. You will need the power of the Sword of Light. Gaia will endow, endow the light upon the sword once again. Who was it that talked about Darkslayer, though? I was sure that was the name of the sword I needed. Was it James? Swordmaster James? Or Leon? Oh, oh, Dark Slayer. There is also the Dark Slayer, which belonged to Gyra. The Moonlight Sword, which belonged to Seath. The sword owned by Meryl Ur. I thought I had a much clearer message from someone saying, you specifically need the Dark Slayer before you go here. It wouldn't have been something Leon actually said to me. It would be in his letter, right? Because last thing he said to me was just a little longer, right? Yeah, it'll be finished shortly. I think I stored your letter. Find the clue to the puzzle of Icarus, our ancestor, and obtain the power as the king. Was it valid? Valid was in here next to uh, somebody. Everybody, Silvo, Ellen, blah, blah, blah. See if became the object of worship, Gyra, object of hatred. Was it Orladun? Oh, I don't want to do this, but I might need to look through every bit of conversation I have and see why I was so sure I needed a sword called the Dark Slayer. Okay, so this thing that Alexander says. You will need the power of the Sword of Light. Gyra will endow the light upon the sword once again. Clearly that's what happened in that scene I saw. The Moonlight Sword was broken, Gyra endowed it with power, and now it's the Moonlight Sword again. Sword of Light, Sword of Moonlight, I mean, it has light in its name. This just doesn't feel right, though. Alright, well, I poked through all the likely-looking spots in conversation and couldn't find anything that refers to Dark Slayer other than uh, James naming it. I'm gonna guess that I just got mixed up with what I read. That seems a little more likely than uh, that there's something more to do here, because, you know, I have the Moonlight Sword, the Ultimate Sword, right? Then what is the Dark Slayer? Because James specifically named it. But the Moonlight... Okay, one more time. James's thing. Because this seems important. Let's look at those exact words. Swordmaster James. I wonder if anybody would have changed their dialogue at this point. He's pretty deep in here. He's this, the second last one. Uh, okay, so, this is pretty deep into his things he said. Powerful weapons fashioned by dwarves and elves, master crafts and yens, Lord Vayrak, 
I told you about Silvarian and Capricorn. I got Silvarian at this point, right? There is also the Dark Slayer, which belonged to Gyra, the Moonlight Sword, which belonged to Seath, the sword owned by Meryl Ur, the swordsman of the High Elves, and also the Triple Fang, which belonged to the King. So I'm assuming Triple Fang is just going to be used on me. Dark Slayer is clearly a different sword than Moonlight Sword. And then this flame. The holy sword you carry is not the correct one. You will need the power of the Sword of Light. Gyra will endow the light upon the sword once again. I was so sure that Dark Slayer was the name of what I needed. I guess I was wrong. Okay, fair enough. Anyway, it's uh, not too much of a walk from here to the castle, right? It's kind of just over there. Hey, if I'm not mistaken, that secret passage up there would totally let me bypass this door. Therefore, get in there with only two of these keys and not to need to find the other two. So that's uh, potential for a pretty big uh, sequence break, it seems like. Neat. Uh, oh wait, hang on. Does this also connect here? It's close enough that it could. I'm gonna try this wall. No, that's just a, a window. But there was one that totally opened. I assume it opens from the other side. I've never seen a one-way door in this game, other than ones that are specifically locked from the other side. So yeah, I think you could actually just skip uh, the first two of... Ah, uh, where are you? Key of the Corridor. Those things. Uh, yes, Key of the Corridor. Open? Open? There we go. <laughs> Had to book it three times before it responded. Alright, I found another zone. What did the map look like where I just left? Okay, this is what it looks like here. Whoops. So yet another new music. Yeah, I'll scan you in a moment, new zone. I just want to see the, the map of this place. Won't look like much. Nope, doesn't look like much. All right. <laughs> Sorry, virtual disk drive. I'm making you work so hard with your virtual read head. Reading this disk. The second floor of the castle. It was soon after Alex returned from the island that King Alfred changed. The king had locked himself inside his chamber after becoming ill. Sounds of struggle could be heard from inside, and the king who emerged seemed alien. Okay, so the king did something on his own. Like, some sort of demonic possession or some kind of situation like that, it sounds like. And then he came out a changed man. So, wait, how does this tie in with the island of Melanet? Um, because Alexander went there in Kingsfield 1, I believe, but Kingsfield 2 was... Was that Alexander? I wasn't named there. Imperial Guards, they are the knights selected to protect the king. They will never retreat in battle and are highly motivated with undivided loyalty to the king. Tragically, they ended up following the evil king without hesitation. And without heads. Don't need those, apparently. Okay, you're pretty aggressive. You have magic. Five Moonlight Sword hits. That's doable. There was a projectile coming from here. Must have been you. Right, I can attack way faster than I was used to. Look at that, that's ridiculous. I can just, like, stun lock you. What? <laughs> this sword is kind of unreasonable. But I earned it, I'm gonna use it. Is that the Orlidan spell? It looked kind of like it. Oh, you have your head in your hand? Yeah, you have your head in your hand. I see. Or you're an empty suit of armor and that's your helmet? It's hard to tell. Yep. Yeah, I can just stand here and hit the button. <laughs> oh, that's sad. Uh, not linear path before. I did have one choice. Or, uh, 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 yeah. Linear path leading up to this.
That is the Odin spell. Or no, it's not. It's a different different symbol. It's the destroy your ears spell. Lots of spells are that. Are you different? No. Are you wearing a different color of you look different from the other one I just killed. Hmm. I'm coming for you, Alfred. I know you're in here somewhere. Oh, I'm going way down to the depths. I wonder if that branching path was uh, where a crystal was. Ouch. Ouch. Okay, that one hurt a lot. Ah, not as much as it hurt my ears. Okay. You. <laughs> We're in the cacophony again. Ah, go away. You're so loud. Sure, you're attacking me. Whatever. It's, it's your noise that's bothering me, really. chest. <laughs> oh hey, there was a silver key chest in here. I think this is the first one I've seen in the uh, in the castle so far. Predite. I think that's up from keys. Yes. And I saw a royal chest. There it is. That might not be the same one. I think there were a few. It's a pick. Okay. It's a dragon crystal. Yeah, I'm being uh, supplied for a final boss fight here is the vibe I'm getting. Oh, a flask. Okay, see now to use that supply I gotta go back. Unless there's a gold fountain built into this place somewhere. Is that a crescent axe? I think so. Or the evil axe? Crescent axe, okay. What's that? Right, that thing I never use, the arrow of light. All these flasks! I already have plenty, but okay, got even more now. This game just gives me so many tools. Like all I could ever want. A second truth glass? Really? Man, imagine getting that this late in the game. Second truth glass. Okay. <laughs> what a weird place to put that. Oh, no, that's just uh, just a that. Uh, key. I wonder how serious Alfred's going to be. He's been built up. That won't necessarily mean anything, though. All these picks. If anything's made of stone, I'm your man to fix it. That's copper. My inventory index changed because I got a water crystal. Oh, that's uh, something. Something. And something. All the gems. Alright, so having looted the storehouse, is there anything more I missed? Like here? No. Having looted the storehouse, I need to turn back now. Okay. Wait, was that? No, okay, so this was the side path for loot. Cool. Um, I have a worry 
that if I go forward any more at all, I might stumble across Alfred and not be able to back away. So I'm going to actually go back for a crystal instead of doing that. Uh, I want to ignore you. This is how I'm going to do it. Uh, well, there are these guys first. Maybe there's a convenient crystal there? I mean, I'll know if I'm walking into an Alfred fight, I'm sure. And there'll be a crystal before that, I'm sure, right? Like, right about here. Yeah! I knew it. Alright, crystal. And then I'm getting a strong vibe that we're probably having a final boss fight next time. Or maybe there's like three whole zones still in here. I can never quite tell with this game. Anyway, see you next time for whatever happens.